Yo, what up, my bad boys? How you doing today? This is uh, some more Skyrim action for you. Uh, last time we just entered this this dwarven dwarven um, uh, place, and oh, he sees me. Oh crap, they all see me. Let's see what we can do here, guys. No, get out of the way, Mark. Get out of the way. Uh, we just entered this place, and uh, it was it was pretty interesting. Uh, there's a lot of robots to fight. And there's a lot of cool things. There's a lot of like magic items and stuff like that. So today, hopefully, we can uh, beat it. I, I assume that I'm, I'm pretty darn close to the end. I don't know why I assume that, but uh, we've been playing for a while. So oh, see, look, they do. They live down here. This is weird. This is the first time I'm seeing any uh, any of these guys. So a bunch of random ore and stuff. Just interesting. What the heck is this made of? It's so weird. So you know what? I guess, you know what? Why the heck not? Um, we will alchemize some stuff. I've got a lot of ingredients right now. The only thing I'm worried about is if those ingredients end up turning into potions, which end up being even more stuff. So let's start off with the things we have the most of. We'll do eggs, and clusters, and death bells, and eggs, and tongue, and oil. And get rid of the oil and do a saber cat eye. Oh, yeah. All fun things, man. See, every single every single one has been been something so far. Oh, it failed finally. Lavender oil and eggs. See, I've got a lot of oil still. I got to use up that oil. Let's do oil and frost salts. Oil, eggs, and a grass pod. I was once discovered in Morrowind. Imagine oil it. turns into everything, man. As a surviving member of your race. Oil. Oh, it failed. Been failing like crazy. We'll just use the top three every single time now, unless it tells me not to. Dude, our alchemy is terrible. Look at that. That's ridiculous. I can't believe they're only in level 25 so far. And all we've got is this left. All right. Quit the alchemizing. So are we still... Yes, I believe we are still good. Is this a fire? What the heck is going on down here, man? A lot of weird things. I will admit that I'm, I'm fairly confused. I saw it... E oh, close the door. We don't want to close the door. So it looks like we're going to be fighting Falmer for a little while. You know, same from the Dwarven guys to the Falmer. These guys aren't very strong, though, seemingly. Um, I mean, the archers are okay, but by, by no means are they like, oh my god, this guy's awesome. Plus, they're just getting burned alive. Like, go ahead, get burned alive. That's what you want to do if you're going to be stupid enough to stand and fire. Palmer sword, yeah, it's not like worth anything either. Why do only some of them have one farmer here? It doesn't make much sense at all. Why wouldn't they have two? So this is like, oh yeah. Oh yeah, if this burns the ground, oh, you're screwed, man. You're totally screwed. So that's like they, where they sleep. They sleep on that weird stuff. So anyways, run! We somehow kind of made that, and it ended up not being too bad. Yeah, they're eating everything. You can use the anvil. Oh, we can actually forge things if we wanted to. That is interesting. Jewelry. No, I can't make anything right now. I know, it's sad. But I can make elven stuff now. I don't know if you guys realize that, but I could if I wanted to. It just takes a lot of random crap that, like, I will never use. I, the only reason I got that is because I eventually want to get up to my uh, dragon armor. And... It's gonna take a while. We're only level 50 right now, so it's gonna take a while to get up there. But eventually, I would, I would, I would love to do it. So, you know, that's kind of the plan, at least. It's good to have a plan, right? Lots of ruined books, dwarf dagger, all unfun things for sure. Oh, dude, there's a lot of them right now. March is in the middle of them right now. That's crazy. 
That's actually a farmer mage. What? They do mage stuff? It's a gloom lurker. It's a good thing he sucks. Hey, Mr. Gloom Seeker. Farmer helmet. Yeah, that thing sucks too. Alright, these guys all suck major balls. And we get more eggs. Alright. So. Cure wounds. I took a saw on accident. Poop. Bear claws. A grass pod. It's like, I don't want to take all the random crap. I just want to take the good stuff. Like a soul gem fragment. I don't want that. A pearl. It's only worth two. I think what I want to that. I don't know if how many soul... How many soul fragments do you need to make a soul thing? Robes and random crap. There's like just so much weird stuff down here. It's just... it's odd. Oh, human flesh. Oh my goodness. It's kind of scary, isn't it? Human flesh, man. So honestly, I believe... Uh, if, if I'm not 100% mistaken... I would find the Dwemer's mechanical that, fascinating if they didn't try to kill uh, this area right over here, this this little thing will bob, it'll lead us to the, the top. So let's check it out. Let's see if we can bring it up back to the top, and then like this will be kind of like a halfway point. Like honestly, this would be perfect if we if 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 it worked out the way I thought it was going to. Which it doesn't seem like it is. How many egg sacks can we harvest? Oh my goodness gracious, there's like twelve. So this led us to nowhere. What the heck's the point of this place? Oh, it did lead us to somewhere, kind of. Is there a lever? I thought I saw a lever. There it is. Nope, that's not a lever. What the heck? Get out of my way, I gotta find a lever. The lever. The lever has there it is, there's the lever. So I believe. If I'm not mistaken, this was the place that we were at before. So, um, this will lead us to the top up there, and then I can go put away my dragon bones and go sell some stuff really quick, and everything will be good. I think that's what I'm going to do. And then we can just hop back down here this time, because now it's finally open. Hopefully I don't have to do that all over again. I don't think I have to go down. I think I have to go up. Oh, yeah, I gotta go down. This is actually a bit of a trek, though, I must admit. It's not like a crazy trek or anything, but... It is going to take a f probably five minutes to get from here to... And then fast travel and stuff. Alrighty. Unless I'm going the totally wrong way and I don't know it. I don't know where I'm at, honestly. Okay, I'm kind of lost at the moment. Heep. Heep a deep. This is the entrance, right? Dude, this is the fo this is forward. We're going forward in this place. I'm lost. I'm totally lost. It's not fun. It's not fun to be lost. And then I if I never found the elevator again, it would be even more upsetting. Okay, stamina, come on, come on back, broski. Alright, so I came through here. Uh, went through here. All right, we're at back at the wintry place. It's a good thing. It's a good sign. Um, I think it was right up here. I think this is where the elevator was. I hope. Uh, this way. I don't know. I don't know, my friends. I'm lost. I'm lost. Getting lost sucks. Oh, wait, wait. I think I remember this. I think I remember this. Yeah, we found it. Alright, alright. So, now we know. Don't go that way. We're gonna go that way. Don't get too far ahead. Shut up, Mark. I'm not talking to you right now. So, hopefully this is the way out. It'll take, like, one minute to get out, hopefully. Hope, hope, hope hopefully. Oh my goodness. 
these places are scary. I'm not gonna lie. Like, I feel like I'm gonna get totally lost. But realistic realistically, like, it's not like a maze. It's just, like, one way to get places, usually, with, like, a couple random odd, like, uh, different areas where you can go in certain places. Woo! To Skyrim! Alright, we made it out. Alright, so now, this is where we entered it over here. Alright, I gotcha. I gotcha. So we're going to actually have to go back to... First pl First things first, we're going to go to Dragon's Reach. Why? So I can alchemize... Not alchemize. Uh, the other one. <laughs> you guys know what I'm talking about. Uh, and get rid of those items and whatever we have extra after that, we can uh, sell. Let's do it. Enchant, that's what it's called. I don't know why I couldn't remember it. Sometimes it just happens, you just can't remember things. We're going to disenchant. Ooh, we can actually disenchant a lot of stuff. This is the thing that I'm still using, which I don't want to get rid of. Um, That's pretty sweet. So, here we go. Elven Armor of the Squire. Wow, there's a lot of stuff here. Elven Shield of Blocking. Hide Armor of Health. Yeah. Hide Armor... Or bracers of archery. So, like, yeah, that's like obviously you don't want to get rid of the dwarven ones, you just want to get rid of the, the hide ones. Illusion, sure. And now. Uh, now we can't get rid of the dwarven archers or, 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 or dwarven bracers of archery. I don't know why I couldn't say that. Sure, why not? And we'll give it the common soul gem. Common soul gem. One more thing to enchant. Uh, the gold necklace, which can probably only do a couple things. Fortify alchemy. Alright. So we did a little bit of enchanting over here. We're going to go sell all the crap that we have, which is worth a lot of money, by the way. Uh, we're going to have to kind of travel between a few mer merchants really quick. And see what we can do. And also, I'll drop off my dragon boats. If, if we can get down to like 150 things that we're carrying, I'm totally down with that. So I know it's silly to fast travel to the same place that I'm already at, but honestly, it works. It That's works. Good. Looking to protect yourself or deal some damage. So look at that. Look at that gold she's got. We're gonna get rid of our weapons. I kind of don't really want these things. I don't want either of these things. They suck. Get of our dagger, our hunting bow of ice, but that thing, an iron arrow, embers, and. That's all good for me as far as weapons go. These things. Okay. And we're all good for this girl. Don't forget to check inside the shop. But to... now we need to go talk to the other guy. And then we might even have to fast travel up up to the Riverwood Trader or whatever. Cause I, I like I don't know, I just go to these places because I like I know them and, and they do they do they, they like, everything. buy everything. So, we need to sell some crap. Alright. I should wear I should wear one of those. You know what, let's do it this way. Let's get rid of the weapons, anything. Nope. Peril. Um sure why not? Sure why not? Ah, oh, sure, why not, I guess. So look at that, we got rid of everything so quickly. Our speech has increased to level 38. Oh what am I even doing? I'm pressing too many buttons. Get out to Whiterun Christ and get over to that Riverwood Trader. So we're going to go back to the Riverwood Trader. See how fast we can do this stuff? It only takes a few minutes. Get it all done. Get it done. Oh, I totally forgot to go in my house, man. Oh, I should have done that first. I said I was going to do it, and then I forgot. Started started running. Thank you and me. Trinkets, odds and ends. So yeah, 750 that gold sort of is perfect. Get rid of this stuff. Potions, sure, why not? Mm -hmm. Frost. Oh, see, there we go. He's out of stuff already. We already we already drained him all. 750 gold. I have 17,000 gold, by the way. I don't know how much stuff costs, like, but what the heck are we going to use 17,000 gold on? I don't even know. So let's go back to white one really quick. And some people, like, uh, a couple people have been asking me, like, how do you load so quick? Like, what do you have going on? Well, yeah, I'm on a computer, uh, and I have my game installed on my C drive, which 
is an SSD. So it makes it faster. SSDs load games faster. So let's put the miscellaneous dragon bones in. Drop, 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 and we're good to go. All right, so I was actually just seeing if anything was changing when I was clicking on it, because things were changing, but it wasn't really changing. So what are we at? Uh, we're at 185. That is not bad. At least we can get 250-something, uh, or 250-ish stuff in there, and let's go back to Elfton. Okay. So, now... This is a lot easier to find than I thought. Once you know where you're going, it's like, oh, that was just that was easy as cake. Just follow the things. It'll lead you to the glacial runes. Alright, so we still have to go down that elevator though. Make sure we don't mess that up. It's really easy to just like keep walking and be like, ah, oh, now we gotta go through this entire place again, and it's gonna take literally forever. Forever. So I'm actually gonna test out this trick that somebody taught me. I don't know if it's gonna save time or not. I don't think it does save time, but let's try it anyways. Now you get your stamina back. So you can just keep doing that as much as you want. I know that. That is actually kind of cool. Especially if I had a little bit more stamina and I could just run like non-stop forever. That would be kind of kind of nice. Because the waiting doesn't take very long at all. So if you're fairly efficient at it. Oh, it didn't work that time. Maybe it doesn't work if you cheat. So we're going to go to the Animal Clary. Let's go. So which way was down? Or, or which way is the way to go? So it looks like, um, I believe we just gotta keep on going this way. Just looking at that thing, it was kind of cool looking. Alrighty, so what do we got? Oh, another one of these places. Another big open area where the dwarves created of things. so many wondrous machines, and yet nobody ever followed in their footsteps. I wonder. I wonder too. Why? Why? Did, oh, there they are. So yeah, these guys. Like, I mean, I mean, they're all right. They're they're not like the worst guys in the entire world. They're just fairly easy to kill. Oh my god, that's a giant spider right there. Frostbite spider. Woo! Take that soul right from the frostbite spider. And we get some eggs, some gold. We'll take the steel arrows, because why not? This guy is going to die without me even touching him, because Mark is awesome. Oops, I took human flesh. Do I actually use human flesh for things? I don't know. I just find it kind of odd to take human flesh. Like, I, just, I, don't, I don't know. I just don't... I like, Even though it's a game, I'm just like, ew. Ew, man. Human flesh. Even though it probably tastes just like animal flesh, I'll be honest with you guys. Probably does. Or meat. I should say meat, not flesh. It looks. It just looks like meat, you know. So there we go. Nothing in here, and we're gonna go to open this door. I'm not guaranteeing that we're like almost done, but I, I have a feeling. So this thing looks like a trap. Activate drip wire. Yeah, totally a trap, man. See that thing? I already broke the trip wire. It can't do me anymore, can it? Doesn't seem like it. The elf. Cathedral. So what's the what's this thing? Pressure plates? Crushes me. Oh yeah, dude, you don't want to run on those things. But they are for show. So I feel like there was something over there. They like there's like pressure plates and everything for a reason. Jump over that. I don't see any more. Oh, there's another falmer. <laughs> And he did. Alright, taking souls like crazy. Another big area. Like, I just don't... I don't know. Like, was there something over here? I'm always curious. Doesn't... I guess there isn't. There isn't anything over there. I'm always curious. Like, oh, if there's two ways to go, and then I go one way, and then like, oh, man, was there something special or fancy or a super, super awesome wow. secret over there? It's like, that's that. I'm snapping to Zelda. Did you look at what?
bonk. See, they got spiders on their team. It's kind of ridiculous. Alright. Very odd looking things, though. Oh my god, so many eggs! Harvest the eggs! And the mushrooms, and the things, and the eggs, and the... Oh my goodness gracious, this is what's going to get my alchemy up, guys. For sure. Steal all the eggs I can. I'm down. They're actually worth a lot, too. They're worth $10. Oh, Dwemer. I, I keep saying Dwemer. Dwemer machines. Eggs, eggs, eggs. And then we're gonna grab some more eggs, eggs, eggs. Add in all the eggs. What if it said, like, eggs are full? <laughs> Yeah, I think it's just because, like, you never come back down to get any more eggs ever. So, they kind of just give you them all at once. Get some grass. Oh, they don't let me get the grass. That's lame, bro. Lame. Even more eggs. Eggs everywhere. Oh, that's a big chest, but with nothing in it? I guess, is that even a chest? I don't know, it's just funky looking. Right? I don't know. I don't know, man. It's funky. Funky fresh, I suppose. If you really want it to be funky fresh, it could be. So we're hopping up here. It looks like this is going to be some sort of level. With some sort of chest. With not so great things in it. So wait, let's see. Oh, it's already open. Perfection. Oh, don't die, don't die. Oh! <gasps> Alright, we only got hurt a little bit. It's like, it goes from hurting just a little bit to hurting very, very, very big bits. And then it goes to dying. <laughs> very, very, very quickly. Like, within like 5, 10 feet, it just like changes like crazy. A dynamo core. I don't know, I'll take it just because it's fun. Oh, here we go. A centurion. Yeah, he actually is pretty strong. I'm glad he's running after the wrong guy. <laughs> this actually makes it a lot easier. I thought we were going to have to fight two of these things. He's telling that thing that he's this. Oh my goodness, did you guys see that? I've never seen one fly before. Do you guys know they could fly? I'll take the dynamic core again. Uh, and key to Elfland lift. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. So is there anything cool or crazy over in these little side areas? I don't think I ever went down here. Glow shrooms. Nothing cool over here. I didn't even know you can go over here, though. This is kind of weird. Oh, wait. You what? Why would they do that, though? Why would they put this area over here if there was nothing, like, actually to get? No, that's so weird. That is really weird. Like, why did he get up here? How did he get up here? Cause like, I mean, look, look, you, you fall down and you, you can't do anything. Oh man, I got more eggs. Look at that ridiculous amount of egg-tastic action right there. So awesome. Alright, um, I'll check out the other side really quick just to see if there's anything cool. You never know. So here is a chest. And a lockpick broke. I'm, oh wait. You do, you go up a level just by using a lockpick, or like go up like level-ish things just by using a lockpick. I did not know that. So that means that the more lockpicks that I break, the better I'm off almost. Kind of. I mean, since I can buy lockpicks, I can just like go up lockpicking levels by doing that. That's kind of, that's interesting. So let's see, oh yeah, there definitely wasn't anything over here. Too bad, so sad. So it looks like we're going to be lifted up over here somewhere. I don't know, there's a lift key, so it just kind of makes sense to me. Oh. I would find the Dwemer's mechanical guardians fascinating if they didn't try to kill everything outside. You can have all the glory for yourself. What was that? Found you. Let's let them kill each other. The girl seems way stronger, so um, we'll attack her. Do 
that guy's dead already. Wow, that guy died really fast. Let's search him. Armor, boots, bracers. Meh, I'll take it. So that girl is... I honestly think Mark can kill the girl by himself. But we will help kill her. And we get her soul! Target... Targe of the Blooded? That's kind of interesting. Wow, she has steel plate armor. That's probably why it didn't do any damage. It's just because she had so much armor, my bow just didn't do anything. So what does this mean? What the heck was that? I don't know. It scared the crap out of me, though. Unlock the gate. Oh, I could have, I could have master locked it. So this is going to bring us back up to the top again, but I don't need to go up there right now. So let's just hop down. And keep on going. We're gonna go to Black Reach. Oh. oh my god, this is awesome looking. This is absolutely awesome. Get him. Get him! Dwarven Sphere. Why does he seem stronger than the other ones? I don't know, he definitely does. He definitely seems strong in the other ones. Maybe because he had a, I don't know, he had two soul gems? I don't really get it. And we're stealing some more souls. And he's got two ears just the way they should have. Hide the corner for a few seconds while I get this up. But no, this is here. He couldn't be done with that already. Two Vulmer ears. See, look at that. All these guys down here, they have two ears. So you can't harvest any of this stuff. But this place, doesn't it just look awesome? Like, seriously. I'm, I'm pretty amazed right now at how awesome this stuff looks. Field laboratory. Oh. Is it laboratory or laboratory? I don't know. I hear some Ninroot. Oh. Crimson Ninroot? And some Ninroot? You know what? Let's alchemize and see what happens when you do. Discover the signet. Oh, okay. Do crimson ninroot and ninroot. Damage health. Only worth eight. That's stupid. That's stupid. Let's get a bunch of crap down here though. Yeah, we'll take it all. We'll take it all. Don't go stopping for a nap. Do -do 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 -do. If you fall asleep in this place, you'll never wake up. Do -do 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 Taking all the flowers, taking all the things, honeycomb, frost sauce, moon sugar, dragonfly, all this good stuff is delicious. Oh my god, I'm gonna eat it all. The knapsack. Tomato. Why do you have a tomato in there? <laughs> why, why, why do you have a tomato in there? It doesn't even make any sense. I missed an egg. So, um. Coolio, couple level. You guys want me to keep on doing stuff, so I am going to do my health up again. I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna get a lot of health for a little while at least. So enchanting, skill enchantment, soul gems, blah blah blah. Recharging the weapon. Okay. Down for that. Health, magic, and stamina enchantments. Can put two enchantments on the same item. Oh my goodness gracious. You guys imagine the amount of ridiculousness that, that would that would bring us. So, uh that's probably where we're gonna end it for today. We gotta discover the uh the, the importance of the red nin root. The crimson nin root. And then oh there's a potion. 
And then we're gonna go around and just find, like, find, I don't know, the glow shrooms, man. These things are just cool looking. I just like them. I just like the look of all the glow, the giant glow shrooms. It's like a mega glow shroom over there. These all just look really fun and interesting. So, uh, as always, thanks for watching, and have a super duper delicious day.